What is up, people? Today we're doing another 60 second live stream breakdown for the February live stream for those of you who don't have an hour to sit down and watch the whole thing. I got all the important things covered, mainly the photos and all the big info. So let's get that countdown started and get into it. First, Steven starts the live stream with a studio update announcing that the entire team has moved over to Unreal 5, so no more Unreal Engine 4 is being used. No Alpha 2 dates or news were talked about other than the level cap will probably be level 35 for Alpha 2, and the content creator program is still accepting applications. In design, we learned that the AI is being worked on, along with the character customization systems, which they will show off next month. It is said to be very in-depth and better customization than most MMORPGs. For environment, we got both some props, a defensive barrier, and a fountain. We also see some new tech on how the roads will change as a node progresses. And on to the best part, we have character art, giving us our first look at the Vec orcs. Then there are a couple of Renkai T poses, a Nikuan dwarf, a Dunir male and female dwarf, and some updated Dunir in tier 5 in-game achievable armor. Then the Kalar human model is updated as well, and we see some new cosmetic armors, the Salt Spine cosmetic mount, some fire foxes, and a hippo which is also an in-game achievable mount. And there you have it, all of the big stuff on the live stream. If you want to check out the full thing and hear the Q&A answers and all that stuff, check out the stream on the Ashes of Creation YouTube channel. Other Otherwise, let me know your thoughts on those new character models in the comments and feel free to use my referral to make an Ashes account if you don't have one. Otherwise, be sure to click that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up, and stay tuned for a lot more to come.